Hi guys, this is going to be real quick. I just haven't used this duck in a little while, so I'm just going to run through it, okay? I'm going to tell you what I'm seeing. I'm going to tell you what I'm seeing. Don't, don't sabotage this new start, okay? Um, we definitely have healing that needs to take place. You're definitely conflicted. Um, you know, you're definitely capable of using your intuition here, okay? Um, if you're unhappy, you're doing it to yourself. There's a lot of heavy weight. I'm not sure. Some of you are definitely drinking. You got yourselves caught up in something. Um... You need to grow, okay? But it, it's you it, it's you that needs to get yourself out of this situation. Um, you're not making a decision to move forward when it comes to some type of relationship because you don't want to not comfort yourself when it comes to something. You're, you're seeking comfort, okay? Um, it is toxic. You have to comfort yourself. It, it's, like, it's like that boomerang effect. You know, I want it. I want it now, and it, it's one of those things, okay? Um, I feel like somebody definitely chose somebody else when it came to something. Um, not really seeing the the best of you, um, what you're capable of. Um, to me, you, you have to move forward. You, you're not... You're not even happy, okay? Um, somebody's nurturing somebody else. You're pissed off. You're fed up. It was taken from you. And you know it was taken. And you're pissed off, okay? Um, so I get it. But there's no color. There's no color in your life right now. You're not seeking your own clarity. Um, you're comparing apples to oranges. You want the relationship back. Yeah, you're tired of the same old shit, but yet you don't want to let go. I think you're going out drinking, hanging out with your friends. It's it's like revenge, revengeful energy. Like, haha, look at me. You know, um, what's that song I'm hearing? It's on the radio. Um, not you make me better. That's Cassie. Um. It's like, you're yeah, nothing without me. I made you who you are. It's something like that. All right, well, yeah, you, you taught this person a lesson. And, and trust me, whomever they left you for, um, karma will serve them, okay? Chances are it, it will not work out. Could they be together for a couple years until they figure it out? Could there be a pregnancy involved with that? Yep. Okay, can it be heartbreaking? Yep. But it, it's definitely one of those things. It's it's most definitely a blessing in disguise, okay? So, your lesson here is to definitely take care of yourself with these unfortunate circumstances. A lesson, please, a lesson. Um, I don't think you can have this back right now. Please do not jump into another relationship. Right now it is time for you. All right. Trust. I accept my inner voice that will always guide me correctly. So it's like, you know, you know where you need to be, where you need to go. You're not accepting something, but it's the best thing for you right now. But you're just, you're not happy about it. And I, I get it. Okay. Um, kind of shitty circumstances for sure. But the divine got you right now, which is nice. Okay. You have all these opportunities to go places. All right. You have to build up your own confidence right now. Take time for yourself. Don't let nobody else get in the way. Create your own happiness. Because the chaos that you're in right now is not happy. Okay? It's it's finding a new a new path. Um, do not jump on this merry-go-rounds again. I, I think right now, whatever... The, there was definitely a breakup. And somebody chose somebody else. And... You're furious, but it's 
it's it's more than that because it's it's like revengeful haha -ha, like look what you're missing out on you're posting stuff on social media so this person sees it but right now this person doesn't give a rat's ass like they do and they don't what they're doing is laughing okay um because they 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 chose somebody else trust me their their path is is not good right now all right like not like worry like oh what's gonna happen it, it's not like that it's just they're dealing with their own karma let somebody else teach this person their own karma okay it's time for you to heal it ended i understand you're you're conflicted the, the, when i tell you the divine got you the divine got you okay um very healing healing energy that they want to give you right now all right justice will be served the way it's supposed to um it's time for you to go within all right it's stop passing judgment stop trying to make the situation better stop trying to get this person back into your life okay nurture yourself you, you need to heal you need to have a new beginning um you're not accepting what happens I understand you're very emotional, but yeah, see, you're not, you're not even moving forward. You know, work's not even going good. Uh, too much, too much gossiping, okay? Um, not seeing the good in things, being brokenhearted. I, I understand you got love, but you got to go towards your own happy right now. This person does not have the key to your heart like you think they do, okay? Right now, they, they don't even know their ass from their elbow, and they're out doing their own thing. So, let this wheel come at you the right way. Okay, um, don't, don't seek revenge. Take care of your children, because some of you have children. Take care of your own place. Create your own happiness. I know you don't want a new start. Everything seems really dark right now, but if you try to look at something in a different way, okay, um, things will get better. Um, and it's not about somebody else coming in. Right now, it's all about you taking care of you, shifting your energy, making sure you're okay. All right, not don't let this person control your energy right now, your outcome, your everyday life, because that's what's happening. Slowly step out of this energy. Um, purples and blues are really, really good for you right now. Okay, plant some new roots. I know you planted roots with this person. Create your own happy right now. Best advice, best advice. Um, some of you, this was a friend. You do know this person. And, and, it, and it's, it's not good. All right. Um, you're, you're turning to, to liquor, too. So slow down on the wine. Um, just, just everything's going on at once. You you know, you need to make a decision to, to walk away from this. All right. It's not look at the humor in this situation. It's look what it's doing to you, all right? You're not nurturing yourself. You're ungrounded. You want back. You want you want this person back and the, and the with somebody else, all right? This is stand up for yourself. It, it's like it, it's that respect, that self-worth that you need, okay? Choose your battles. Why go back and forth? I feel like some of you, this already happens, and you're back and forth sleeping with this person. And it, it's almost like every chance you get, you step in. Every time you sleep with this person, you, you, you step in and you tell this person. Well, this person doesn't care. This person's like, yeah, whatever. They believe you. They don't believe you. It, it doesn't matter. They don't care because it, it's, like it's like a game between the three of you right now. It's crazy. It's crazy what I'm seeing, what I'm feeling. You need to step out of this. And then when this person comes back around, you say, sorry, not sorry. Because this person knows you're chasing. The person knows they can have both of you. This person's having their cake and eating it too. Whether you agreed on it or not, I don't think this was an agreed situation ship. I think somebody just got themselves in a situation ship like this. But the thing is, you want this guy back or vice versa. But right now... They're living, they're living it up. They think they're living it up is what they're doing. But you need to find your own balance and let this go. Pick and choose your battles. Why are you going back and forth with somebody? Why are you giving this other person the satisfaction? Because, yeah, you might be sleeping with them here and there and ratting them out. But at the same time, they're still together. All right? Because now it's not even about this person. 
Now you're battling with this other chica. For what? For what? What's that song? Turn down for what? I don't know what that's all about, but that's in my head. Okay. Um, take care of yourself. Let me see if I can pull you some best advice. <clears throat> don't let this petty shit get in the way. All right. Go through this transformation. Have a new start without this person. It's being guided. Guided. I already told you. I already I already knew that the high priest is popping out strong. You probably had a past life with this person. Yeah, I get it. You feel like it's a soulmate. But right now, this person's having their cake and eat it too. How about you show them what it's like to be an adult and step into new energy and take care of your own. If this is a meant to be scenario, it will come back around. But I'm telling you, <clears throat> it won't be for a little while. Let this person keep making foolish decisions. Okay. Um, you got something very spiritual here. Okay. It, but it's like in your subconscious not knowing how to go with the flow, the guilt, I don't know what that is, lack of maturity, all right, um, finding, just finding yourself again and, and understanding this is a shit-ass scenario, you're, you're not handling the silence very well, you, you just want, 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 okay, um, what's that song by Rihanna, what you want, 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 what you want, 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 give it to me, baby, Give it to me, baby, one more time. Would you? It, it's what it is. It's that. It's that flirtatious. It's the I know I can have it if I wanted it. Like you know, you can hit this person up anytime. Sometimes they'll be like, Nah, I'm not even gonna bother, you know. And then other times they they hit you back up and, What's up? You know, like they want to make sure that they're, they're leaving that door open. Don't let this person get the best of you. It's dead. Let it go. Stop processing it. You don't need this person in your life. Three months from now, you're going to be like, wow, thank you, court. Because, wow, you know, that color is going to start popping through. Nurture you. Nurture your family. Go towards the unknown. You got that magician energy that you're not using. You, you've, you've learned throughout the years. You might not have um, mastered this situation yet, but you got this. Stop nurturing, coddling this person. <clears throat> I know it hurts, but more right now it's more about getting back in revenge. Please look at it this way. This person's literally having their cake and eating it too. All right, so don't, don't do that. Don't belittle yourself. Don't disrespect yourself. Let this person be on them every way. <clears throat> if it's meant to be, it's meant to be. It will come back around another time. Nurture yourself. Get on a new journey. Start looking at the color. Start looking at the brighter side of life. Start accepting the change. Go with the flow. Take care of you. Take care of your babies. Take care of your priorities. Okay? Um, you got new beginnings. If you choose to let them come at you. But right now, take care of you. Nurture you. Whatever it is it takes. All right? Step out of this energy. This ick, ick energy. You're looking at me like, eh. Yeah, some of you are not going to. But um, if you choose not to, I will tell you, you'll be in this cycle with this person off and on battling for a very long time. Nobody deserves that. You don't deserve that. Stop thinking you, you got the upper hand and, and this is a win-win. <clears throat> it is not. Yeah, some of you are not going to. And then others, it's just it's a, it's a rough patch and it's going to get better. This person is, is, is happy about eating their cake and having it too. Okay, so... Just so you're aware of that, it's, it's, not, it's not a love thing. It's a cat and mouse thing, okay? I mean, don't even give this other girl, or vice versa, the satisfaction anymore. Like, shut that shit down. Sh show this person what it's like to be an adult and, and to be, you know, more worried about yourself. I mean, let this person have him. Like, have him. <laughs> like, what did you get out of it? Nothing. Nothing right now. You think that shit's not going to backfire on this person? It will. All right, the, the two of them are in a very comic lesson right now.
It won't work out between the two of them. When when somebody leaves somebody for somebody else, never ever does it ever get to the bottom of a situation. Even if it's 20 years later, they find themselves not wanting to be together or how do we fix this? It's so much of a struggle because shit just was not done properly. Shit did not go down the way it was supposed to. It's a very, very karmic lesson. And they could last a couple years, but they, they won't be happy. Can they have kids in the meantime? Yep, but I'm telling you, it is not your time. You got so much bigger and better. It, it's, it's so comic. I, I really, truly feel this person stepped in to teach you a lesson. This is not the first time you've done this. You've done this repetitively. It is time to step out of it. It is no way to live your life. Stop talking about it with other people, too. It's just getting fed into, fed into. Stop, stop putting it out on social media. If you're doing that, stop doing that, too. Block these people from your life right now. I understand you might have kids with this person, but until they want to step up and take responsibility and take care of their child the way they're supposed to be, instead of you or them pulling out your heartstrings and vice versa. It's, it's like it's the, whoever has child, you guys, children, you guys are using this. Okay, you're using it as a tactic. It's lousy. Don't do that. You want to see your child? Here's the time. Here's the day. Come see your child. You're also stopping this person from seeing the child because you don't want the child around this woman. And I get that. But in all reality, that's it's kind of out of your hands. It is what it is. You found yourself in this situation because there's been plenty of times you had that chance to get out and you didn't. So it's a lesson. If it's a, If he's a good father, let him be the father. If he's a lousy father... And you know they're in a, a rough situation and it's not a good environment, then so be it. But if you know there's a lot of love for that child and, and that child will never be put into jeopardy, then then let it let it just flow. There's there's no way around it. It's a tough, tough scenario. But right now you're you're using that child as, as bait. Don't be that parent. Let that child make their own decision. When they get older, trust me, they're going to know who stepped up to the plate. They're going to know who took care of them. Sometimes it's, it's unfortunate when you put yourselves in those type of situationships and there's nothing you can do about it. But just tell yourself, do what's best for you and your children right now. Don't use the, the kid as bait. Okay. Take care of you. Nurture you. Nurture your children. That's a tough, tough scenario we just talked about, but... If they're a good father, then, you know, just say, have a conversation. I, I know we have our ins and outs and we battle, and, and but enough's enough. And in all, all reality, I, I'd like you to respect me. If you can respect me, please don't bring this person around my child. Chances are they will because I don't see any respect here. Nobody's got respect for anybody, not, not even self-respect in this situation right now. Okay? But you'll get there. You'll gain it. You will. Okay? But um, just do your best. Such a tough scenario. Truly, truly is. But it's a, it's a harsh lesson and it needs to be learned. You don't want to do this for a couple more years. You just don't. Okay. I love you guys. Bye.